Hey, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. I'm Mikkel. Like, comment, share, subscribe. Hope everyone is having a rewarding day. I'm also having a rewarding day. I appreciate all the love and support. And thanks again for tuning in with me for another video. For today's topic subject title, it's going to be on, it's going to be about, it's going to be titled, Will You Feel Unwelcomed? That is not home. Home is not when you feel unwelcomed, uninvited, out of place. That is not home. Home is not when you don't feel the warmth and the good inside of it. And when I say home, I'm talking about our hometowns, our cities, and our states that we was born in. Will you feel unwelcomed, uninvited, unloved, no warmth? from your hometown we feel those feelings and going through that in your hometown in your cities like in your states that that is not home that is not home those saying is home is what a heart is and we and we when you're in your hometown your city and your state you feel no warmth, no love, you're not feeling good at the heart. You feel like you is not welcomed, not invited. You feel out of place and you're being rejected like the outcast. But that is not home. And in my hometown of Baltimore, Maryland, my city and state, I feel rejected. It's like I'm the outcast. It's like I'm the oddball. I'm the odd one. I don't feel no love, no warmth. People here, the citizens that's in society here in Baltimore, Maryland, they just act crazy, weird, and strange. They're looking stir and be weird in a strange way and they act rude they're moody acting they're not nice they're not pleasant I feel like the outcast I'm rejected I feel like I'm not welcomed I feel uninvited I feel like my hometown is telling me you're not welcomed here you're not welcomed here Raquel, you're not welcome here. I feel like my hometown, city and state, is just screaming at me, saying, you hear me, Mikkel? You're not welcomed. You're unwelcomed. You're uninvited. You're not invited. So I feel like being here, being in my hometown, has run its course. I have outgrown it. I've outgrown my hometown. I feel, and I feel like the Most High is speaking to me. He's speaking through me and telling me it's time to go. Don't waste no more time. It's time to leave. It's time to go. It's time to get out. It's time to Spread your wings and branch abroad. It's time to go abroad and spread your wings. Spread your branches somewhere else. It's time for new experiences. New scenery. It's time for new people. It's time to be around new people. New faces. New environment, new atmosphere. 
new surroundings. It's time for just like a new circle, like a new space. It's time to be in a whole new scenery. And I've been praying about this for so long. I've, I've been praying and thinking about this for a long time now. This is something that's been this is something that has been weighing down on my heart. It's been weighing down on my spirit, on my soul. And I've been just thinking and praying and dwelling on this for a long time. It's been a while now. It's been some years now. The Most High, the Most High God, Yah, Yahweh, has given me confirmation and assurance that it's time to go. Most High Yah has given me so much confirmation and assurance that it's time to separate from your hometown everything in it and everyone in it it's time to separate from your family it's time to separate from everything and everyone in your hometown in your city in your state it's time to separate from all the fake associates just it's hard to it's time to separate it's time to disconnect separate leave and get detached from everyone and everything in your city in your state and in your hometown the most high has strongly given me this confirmation and assurance with authority he has given it to me with his authority, with his power. I can feel his power and authority when he gave me and showed me this answer and this route to go and this route to take. I'm listening. I trust the Most High. I'm listening. I'm obedient. I'm obeying. I trust that he is always leading me, guiding me in the right way, in the right path, and in the right direction at all times. I trust that like, it's always working out. And even when I think the things is not working out, it is working out. And I'm starting to see this more and more and more that they say, he don't come when you want him to, but he still come one time. He's still right there. He still is an on-time God. So just I was chosen ones, I always think that no matter what things look like in the circumstances and the challenges, remember, in the background, things is always working out for you. Things is always working out. Just remember, in the background, everything is always working out. And sometimes we lose things, the like valuables, money, cars, homes, and we think it's the end of the world. But I'm here to tell you, it's not the end of the world because this is something, you're going to get something better in return you want to get something better for your situation in return so like I say things may look blurry and dim and gloomy like there's no hope at the end of the tunnel but there's hope at the end of the tunnel and remember 
in the background. Things is always working out. In the background, everything is always working out. Everything and things is always working out for the better. And it takes a lot to get that faith and trust. But you get it. I'm <laughs> I'm still struggling. I'm getting there more and more. I'm getting more faith and trust in the most high and I'm getting more faith and trust in myself. I'm getting more higher with oneness with myself. It takes time and practice. I'm getting there. I still struggle, but I'm getting there. I see progress. I see progress in myself. And I'm getting there step by step, bit by bit, inch by inch. I'm getting there more and more. I'm progressing slowly and gradually more and more. Life's a journey. <laughs> Life's a journey that's full of surprises. Life is life is ups and downs. Life is never just stable at one level. Life is ups and downs. Life is a bumpy roller coaster. It's a wild roller coaster. But I'm holding on for the ride. <laughs> I'm holding on for the ride of of life. I'm holding on I'm holding on for the bumpy and wild roller coaster of life. It's okay if you don't have everything all figured out. None of us do. Just keep living. Just keep living in the present moment. Just keep living in the moment. And keep learning and keep and keep learning from your experiences. Always keep reflecting back on and keep learning from your experiences. And learn from all of your mistakes. Improve your mistakes. Just keep improving. And keep trying to do better. Always try to do better. And be better. Than the day before. Okay. I appreciate all the love and support. But if home don't feel like home. Then leave. It's time to leave your family. Friends. Associates. Old school classmates. Oh, church members, neighbors, it's time to leave your environment. It's time for you to adapt to a new environment. Adapt, see, experience, live in a new, a new environment, a new surroundings, a new atmosphere, a new circle, a new space. It's time for all of that. Well, home will feel, well, home is not where the heart is. No love, no warmth, no caringness towards you, no compassion to you. You feel like you not welcomed, unwelcomed, not invited, uninvited. It's time to pack the bags up and leave. It's time to pack your bags up and leave in your car to a new city, town, a state, a new hometown. Or it's time to pack your bags up and get on a Greyhound bus or get to the train station or get to the airport and fly somewhere else. <laughs> fly out. When home is like that, there's no love and when there's no love and just unwelcomeness, uninvitedness, it's time to pack your bags up and get to stepping. It's time to move on to somewhere else. It's time to move on to new pastures. <laughs> new green pastures. It's time to just move on and travel somewhere else. I appreciate all the love and support. Thanks again for tuning in with me for another video. I will see you all again in my next video. And the rest of your rewarding day. I'm also going to enjoy the rest of my rewarding day. Well, love to all the chosen ones that's out there. I love you all. I truly and sincerely mean that from the bottom. I'm a heart. My chosen ones. Bye. And again, like, comment, share, subscribe. It's your girl, Mikkel. Sign it out. I'm out. Until next time, I'll see you. My love, all love. I'm out. And for love.